Hello and welcome back to our FCS Dynasty. Today we got a doubleheader again. South Dakota State taking on Southeast Missouri State. And our second game is going to be North Dakota State hosting the 0-7 McNeese State Cowboys. But let's get into this one first. 24th ranked Jack Rabbit, 6-2 on the year with one of the worst defenses in the country. But the team they're facing today also has one of the worst defenses in the nation. Both of them in the triple digits for defensive ranks for yards per game. So pretty rough right there. But their offenses are both pretty good as well. So this is typical Big 12 football here today with the Jackrabbits and the Red Hawks. Red Hawks only 2-4 and four on the year. Uh, they did beat FIU, which is a really good win. That's the only loss on the season for the Golden Panthers. They played Southeastern very close. Southeastern, of course, 7-0 on the season. They lost to Nichols State. They beat North Dakota State. VMI absolutely destroyed them, but the Cadets, they have a great defense. And this is today's game right there. Let's take a look quickly at the offense for the Jackrabbits. Tremaine Watson is the starting quarterback. We will see some Lamar Jackson here today. And Jalen Evans is also in on a couple formations as well. The running attack has been doing pretty well so far for the Jackrabbits. We've been trying to get the ball to the halfbacks a little bit more lately. And it's been working out for him. And Simo's on offense first. Rodgers gets the catch. And he's already into Jackrabbit territory. Second down and 13. Kelly on the carry. Kelly to the outside. Kelly to the end zone. Simo strikes first very quickly. 51-yard touchdown run. And that was just way too easy. Let's see what the Jackrabbits can do. Jackson rolling around. He's going to throw it up, and it's caught by Jack Marks, and he is inside SEMO territory. Marks now with 14 receptions on the year. High snap for Watson, and he is sacked. That has been a big problem for them this season. A lot of high snaps, and there's another one. Watson over the middle, deflected up and intercepted by Lloyd, and he's going to go left side here on the return. Tremaine Watson shuts that return down at the 50-yard line, but another pick here on the season for Watson. That's his 11th for the true freshman. Simo looking to take a two-score lead now. Right is going to run it. Quarterback, left side, first down. Jamar Hicks on the stop. Hicks with 36 tackles on the season. And Wright's going to take off again. He's got blocking, and he's inside the red zone. 78 yards on the ground already for Southeast Missouri State. And now they're going to pass it right side. Newell has the first down, breaks the tackle. And Goku Leaf saves the touchdown at the five-yard line. First and goal, Kelly waltzes into the end zone. His second touchdown of the ball game already. And he is just decimating his defense on the ground. Jack Rabbits trying to find an answer. Here's Chad Collins. And he's got a nice run here on the option. Breaks a tackle and gets up to about the 28-yard line. Collins closing in on 800 rushing yards for this season. And here's Daly Redding carrying a defender. And Redding now over 500 yards rushing this year. Mark Jackson, quarterback keeper, right side. First down, Jax. Shotgun set for Watson. He's going to throw a quick pass left side. Daly Redding spins after a broken tackle, picks up eight yards. They've been trying to use him in the passing game a lot more. He's got 11 catches on the year now. Jackson throws it up, and it's caught. Robs North is there, and he finds the end zone. He has just 10 catches on the season, but five touchdowns. Such a big target in the tight end position. The Jackrabbits find the end zone, finally. Not for the extra point, and they are going to miss this one wide right. So it's 14 to six after a 92 yard drive. Defense needs some stops here. Needs a deep pass right side. Major can't get there. Muhammad is gonna take it all the way. Major showing some major hops on that. But just couldn't get to the ball. 78 yard touchdown strike. Goodness gracious. And they got the personal foul for talking right there, but it doesn't matter, they still make the extra point. And that was a huge, huge touchdown. To make the two score ball game yet again. 
Yes, yes, we know. Unsportsmanlike, but it doesn't matter. They made the extra point. It's 21-6. Here is Lamar Jackson take it off, and he gets it up to the 46-yard line. The Discord Pick'em has the Jackrabbits winning this one. 23 votes to 3. And right now, it's not looking so hot. Here's Reinhardt Irmandowski with a nice catch. His first of the ball game inside the 10-yard line. Irmandowski with 25 catches on the year now, over 700 yards. And Daly Redding is going to find the end zone here on a nice touchdown reception, his second of the season. Go for two points. Jackson is sacked. He does not get the two-point conversion. So it is still a two-score game, 21-12. Simo on offense. Pass left side. Rodgers was wide open on the sideline. And that was another first down. Right to throw. Right side, wide open. That's the halfback, Kelly. And he gets it up to the 40-yard line. This offense having zero issues today. And here's Kelly breaking a tackle and finding the first down marker. On the goose, on the goose. Right, hot routing a receiver. Throw deep shot, he's got a man wide open, and it's Muhammad again beating Goku Lee. The freshman corner having a rough game out here today. It's 28-12. Redding on the carry, jukes a man and picks up the first down. He's got five carries today, averaging eight yards per carry. Watson taking a deep shot for himself, and he's got Erwandowski for the touchdown. It's 10th of the season. What a beast. 50 yard touchdown pass. And they go for two points again. Jackson, quick pass left side. Got Collins, and he's got the two point conversion. That brings it back within one score. It's 28 20. We got a barn burner here, folks. Play action from right, and he's got a man wide open again, and I think it's Muhammad. It is, and Major cannot get there. Touchdown, Sebo. 75-yard bomb. Man, oh man. Jack Rabbit's trying to get the ground game working again here. And that's Collins for the first down. He's got 773 yards on the ground this year. Five touchdowns. Not a bad season for the freshman. Jackson, left side. And Collins wide open but missed the mark. And the Jack Rabbit's punted away. And Major misses a tackle. Kelly in the open field breaking more tackles. And he's going to get it up past the 45-yard line. Simo moving the ball down the field with ease today. And right all day to throw it. Finds a man. That's great for the first down. Jackrabbits just have no answer for this offense. And there's a fumble, but it's recovered by right anyway. Oh, my goodness. Everything just bouncing in favor of the Red Hawks. And here is Wright on the option, and he's going to fall into the end zone for another CMO touchdown. And that'll make it 42 to 20 at the half. Zero defense being had here today. Over 700 yards of offense in the first half. Come on. Wright play action, and that pass is dropped. So finally, a negative play here for the Red Hawks. Throw it. He is sacked. Frank Theory gets in there for the sack. That's his seventh on the season. And his 14th for his career. And there is the thumbnail, folks. Watson is going to be dropped. And that was on third down, but there's a face mask, so they get the first. So they finally catch a break. And here is Collins getting the carry. The freshman gets the edge. And he gets up to the 25-yard line. Nice run from him. He's got 50-plus yards today. Look at those stats, folks. Almost 400 yards of offense for Simo. 350 for the Jackrabbits. Here's Watson to the end zone. Jack Marks is there untouched for the score. That's his third touchdown this season. And he now has 15 catches. Head coach Jim Langer wants to go for two. Here's Jackson. He's got the two-point conversion. For the back of the two touchdowns is 42-28. But the defense just could not get a stop to save their lives. There's a forced fumble, but it's recovered by Simo again. And a face mask. On the defense. My goodness. So they get two fumbles in this half, and they cannot recover either of them. And here is a pass out to Newell, who's still going inside the red zone. 
right 296 passing yards today. And he's going to throw it again here. To the end zone, wide open is Miller. I do not know what Goku Lee was doing on the play. It looks like he might have been taking a nap. It's 49-28. Jackrabbits looking for answers. Daily Redding, can he be the answer? Huge run up to midfield. Big time run by the sophomore. Third down and one. Action Jackson in there at quarterback. Is he going to take off? No, he's going to pull back. And yes, he's going to take off. He's got the first down easily. Looked like he was looking downfield, but nobody got open. Jackson trying to take off again. He does not pick up the first down. Big stop there. It's fourth and three. Jalen Evans in at quarterback, throws it up. And that might have been pass interference there, but they do not call it. And that's a turnover on downs. And another broken tackle by Kelly. My goodness, he is just unstoppable today. Watch out for Simo next season, folks. And there's Muhammad. Look out. Muhammad is gone again. I believe that's his third touchdown catch of the game. And it's 56-28. South Dakota State getting blown up here today in conference play. Collins, Harry, right side, or left side, excuse me. A yard shy of the first down. Third down and one. Redding gets the first and more. Jukes to the outside. He's got speed up to the 43. Personal foul. And tack on 15 yards for the personal foul face Watson to throw, and he is hit as he throws, and somehow Reinhard Wendowski comes down with the football. He is amazing. My goodness. What a catch. Quadruple coverage over there. Fourth quarter. Jack Rabbit's down, four touchdowns. And Daly Redding is going to get in there for the score. That's his second today, 11th on the season. He's got 13 Total touchdowns on offense this year. Pretty good numbers. But this defense of South Dakota State is just letting them down. And they're going to go for two points again here. And Jackson doesn't get it. I guess when you're down four touchdowns, you just got to try to get as many points as you can. Pass left side. Miller has it again. Pass the 25-yard line. Jack on five yards. David Redding out there playing some safety. McDonald in that quarterback now, and he is going to have himself a touchdown pass to Flowers. It looks like Simo has all their backups in. And they have a 60-burger. It's 63-34. Lamar Jackson in there, throws it left side. wendowski has got it inside Simo territory. And a lot of face masks here in the second half. Watson to throw. Throws it up, deep shot, left side, has his man. That's Brobs North again inside the five-yard line. I think that's his second catch today. And Watson is picked off in the end zone. Oh, my goodness. Oh, but it rains and pours, folks. They do get the ball back, though. Game just about over here. And Jackson throws it up. Jack Marks wide open, and he's inside the red zone. Trying to make this a little more respectable. Jackson, left side. Jacob Coleman making an appearance for the first time. That is his 27th catch this year. He's now over 500 yards receiving. Jackson to the back of the end zone. And Dayton down has the touchdown. The first of his career. Oh, my goodness. And that's actually going to be the thumbnail, folks. I thought the other one with Frank Theory was going to be, but my goodness, that was an amazing catch. Jackrabbits went for two again. They didn't get it. Simo punting the football away with a minute and a half left. And here is Jamar Hicks. Going to return this up the right sideline. Jamar Hicks is going to take this one all the way. And that is his sixth career punt return for a touchdown. Are they going to go for two again? Why not? Jackson, sacked. He doesn't get it. And that is going to be it, folks. South Dakota State, ranked 24th in the nation, falls to the 2-4, now 3-4, Southeast Missouri State Redhawks. Big time win for that program. And another disappointing loss for the Jackrabbits this season. Their defense just, they can't get it going.
We got the star halfback out there playing defense. And there is over 1,200 yards of offense combined in this ball game. Absolutely outrageous. No defense to be had. And that, like I said, that's that's typical Big 12 football for you. So the Discord pick'em was completely wrong. Simo with the three votes. Colin Northrup, Jeffrey Clark, and Mason Stonewall all selected Southeast Missouri State to win this ball game. And that is it. My goodness. I, I really just feel bad for the Jackrabbits. Their defense, they're just, they have no depth. They have Frank Theory on the defensive line. They have no linebackers. Mason Smith, their halfback slash linebacker, has been injured for the majority of the season. And he is really um, probably the best tackler on the defense. We got Chris Major at strong safety. He has over 150 tackles in his career. But he, he has to run around the field like a madman because there's just nobody else. And it's a little rough. They've got two corners, but one of them's out there playing free safety now because the non-subscriber free safety just been getting beat all season long. So Jamar Hicks made the move to free safety. And they have one corner, freshman Goku Lee, who we saw get burnt like toast quite a few times in this ball game. He had one pass deflection, though. He's got that going for him. But again, another disappointing loss. Jackrabbits not going to be ranked after this week, unfortunately, as they fall to 6-3 and three on the year. Players of the game, Daily Redding, Reinhardt Wendowski, and Lamar Jackson. Wright, Muhammad, and Kelly for the Red Hawks. Our next Jackrabbit football game, they will be hosting the Sam Houston State Bearcats. That'll be a good one. Look forward to that Big 12 game. And I'll see you guys later with North Dakota State and McNeese State. Till then, take it easy, guys.